What's going on guys? Thanks for checking back in with Soul Ties. This is Tony here. I wanted to talk to you today about the most anticipated release of this year, the Jordan 1 Travis Scott's. Let's talk about the sneakers app drop. Sneakers app was set to launch today, May 11th at 7 a.m. And as soon as they dropped, you know, it goes from coming soon to the price. You hit the price. You hit buy now. I was having payment issues. Everybody was. Everybody was having payment issues. They weren't accepting the payment. Uh, I would check my address, check my, my card, make sure it was right. It should be right because I have it set up through PayPal and Apple Pay. And as a backup, I have my cards in there by themselves. None of these payment methods were working. And it was, it was crazy. It, it took about 30 minutes. So finally, I had to sign out log back in and at that point i was it was like 28 minutes later it was 7 28 and i was like they're gone they're all gone and uh i signed out signed back in and i thought my app wasn't going to be able to load back up at all because i didn't have any wi-fi I, I was at work and i just thought you know once i log out i was i didn't want to do that because i was scared that i you know the app wouldn't allow me back in because it happened to me yesterday during the sneakers pass and I did it and it surprisingly loaded back up I tried it again and finally I was able to get in line at least I got in line and I waited and I waited and I waited and it said pending and finally like about maybe six to seven minutes it told me that they were sold out they were gone I tried to see if there were any other sizes available. Maybe I can trade for my size or flip or whatever. Nothing was available. They were gone. And, man, that's crazy. I mean, took an L, um, but oh well. You know what? I thought this shoe would, would uh, I don't know how many pairs were released exactly. Some were saying 38K. Some were saying up in the 100, 108K. I'm not sure, but I thought the resale would go down. Um, man, everybody and their mama was going after this shoe. Uh, I follow a couple of um, overseas uh, sneaker shops on IG, and man, they were showing. That I was seeing the the crowds in China. The crowd was insane. The crowds in in um, in Europe and and stuff like that. It was. It, they were crazy. The lines were crazy. Everybody wanted these. So. As soon as sneakers, the, after 30 minutes, seven, around 7.30, I checked StockX. And before the drop, the sneakers prices had dropped to like around $800. And after, they had shot back up at least $100 more. They were up till I seen the highest pair, maybe like $938, $950, somewhere around there. And then they settled back down to around $900. So these did not do what I expected. I thought they would drop down and no, they went up. So, and they're probably going to go up even higher and higher. Um, they might drop a little just because once sneakers ships their pairs out, people are going to try to sell them and they're going to be undercutting each other. Who knows? Um, but this was a desired shoe. Everybody wanted it. And so, and today reflected that, you know, they were hard to get. Uh, didn't hit on any raffles. Um, but, oh, well, I wish I could have the pair of the Jordan 1's um, Travis Scott's behind me but unfortunately I don't but thankfully I have these to kind of take a little bit off the sting of not getting these um, yeah so that's pretty much how today went so let me know if you copped let me know down below in the comments let me know if you copped what size um, you know congrats to all those who copped I'm kind of salty but congrats all right, thanks for checking in with Soul Ties. Checking out. Peace.